crisp novice maiden chase. Obviously, Chris is without doubt Australia's greatest chaser. Must have been a lot of daylight between that and the rest of the field in Australia back in the day. But up the top, Dave Browles for Paul Rhodes, World of Warlocks, uh, Deceiver, Juniper Golf, the favourite, Jim Murray, 5 to 4, Molly Boots, and Silver Lebedotti for Darren Thompson. Racing. And over the first they go. Molly Boots, early leader, World of Warlocks. Surprising that isn't the favourite. Silver Libidotti. Widest runner is the favourite, Juniper Golf. They come to the second and we've lost one already. Bad luck, Darren. Silver Lebedotti is out. Yeah, it always sucks when that happens. And over the third they go, and World of Warlocks takes up the running. Should be hard to run down from here. It's obviously got very good hurdle form. should be able to open up the chase account today second Molly Boots third Dave Brailsford Deceiver and Juniper Golf oh we've lost to another one there Molly Boots bad luck Stu Molly dropped the jockey and over the fifth of 18 so only four left. Three mile affair. Wonder if any of them will get pulled up. And up to six. Slow jump by the leader, but it's got a handy break on him. Come on down here, two miles left to run. Over the seventh they go. I'm running up the home stretch here. It's been a big week of racing. Been some upsets. And there's a couple of least two very happy trainers they may have picked up career best wins come on down to the eighth and over they go world of warlocks running nicely dave brailsford second juniper golf third deceiver down to the ditch. See if we got close to it but went over nicely. Eleven furlongs left to run and over the tenth they go. Fast jumps there from Deceiver and Juniper Golf. <coughs> Dave Brailford at the tail at the 12th. Another good jump there by Deceiver. And they come on down here and we've got a mile left to run. So two thirds of the way through the race. And they all jumped that quite nicely. World of Warlocks, handy leader here over the 14th. Got a bit of hang time there. 
conceded at least a length. Dales, Brayford and Deceiver together and about three away to Juniper Golf, the favourite, the pre-race favourite. Thinks it's going to be hard to run down World of Warlocks. It's a pacey horse, so when it hits the flat it should be full of running each time it lands. Moving forward again is Deceiver, trying to get closer to World of Warlocks. Dave Brails for Juniper Golf, over that one they go. Nice jump by Juniper Golf, the favourite, starts to come into the race nicely at the right time. And World of Warlock puts the foot down and opens up a two-length break on Juniper Golf. Then about three or four to Dave Brailsford and Deceiver looks to be one pace now. Run on down to the two furlong marker. Two more to get over and they come to the second last. They jumped it together. Juniper Golf puts the head in front. They're starting to draw away now. So it looks like it was the favourite for the right reasons. One more to get over it. They come to it. Oh, jumped it fast, Juniper Golf. And it's got a handy break. Running on is uh, Dave Brailsford. But it won't get beat here now. Juniper Golf comes down to the wire. And wins from Dave Brailsford, World of Warlocks third, and Deceiver fourth. So congratulations, Jim Murray. The bookie's got it right with Juniper Golf. Dave Brailsford second for Paul Rhodes. Third, World of Warlocks for Joshua Sutherland. And Deceiver was fourth for Martin Leadham.